we are going to make a games website, a website where people can play games. Isn't that so exciting? Okay, so we are just going to go to blank templates and do the one that says start from scratch, click edit. And now we're going to click on add and we're going to click search and we're going to type um, games and we are going to, to click this one that says gamify game maker and we are going to click open. And now we're going to click add to side. And we're going to click allow and add. And now we're going to scroll this down like that until it's like that on the middle. And now we are going to press two times our, our, um, the left side of our mouse. Where, where, so I have a mouse right now, and I'm, and what we need to do with the mouse is that we need to click on this, and then click on it two times. And now we're going to put this there, and now we're going to click create your game, get started. And now this will take us to this page. You just need to put it here, your name. And your last name and your email. And speaking about email, if you have any question, please email me at eggwebtood at gmail.com. Okay, so, and now we're going to click get started. And I'm just do, going to do a example with this one. So to make, to put like a game, I'm just going to put one. Um, so that you can see just, an, just as an example and then so that you can see like, how to put it and then that will appear we're going to click we're going to do like a preview of the game that you choose so for example this one like that and then we're going to click next step Okay, just wait. Mm, I don't know why this is happening. Um, if that happens, like if what happened to me, like you couldn't go to the next page, happens to you, just click there and just click there in the settings button and click continue setup so if that happens to you and now you just need to put here a name of your game so i'm just going to put that and like the description you just put a description and um, the title of your play button that you can put play now or anything you want you can upload your background image and you can put a game over text. And now we're going to go to next step. And just wait until that loads. And then here you can do like a preview. Like, no, not a preview. Like you can customize your game. So you can put like that. Like anything you want. Like for example this. Or that you can 
Just do many things and then click next step. And then add a form title and a first name. Like for people to put like their first name, like to play, I don't know. Um, here um, you can just, if you don't want that, then you can just delete it and then click add. And then like this, you can delete it. Just click add and click add. And click add. And then this one we can delete it. And this one we can delete it. And like we just put here. First day and birthday. So maybe you want that. Like people need that to play the game. You can just add like city, address, company, country, email, gender, last name, middle name, or our others. Yes. First and then when you finish doing that, you're going to go to next step. And then you um, can just do a preview of the game again to see if it works. And then we can go to back to my games. And then you'll see this one is already published. And then it will look like this. So we just publish this game. So then the people to play it will, it will appear this for the people, right? And then we are going to put play now. And that is where the people um, can play this game. And first is that black screen will appear. But then the game, you just need to like wait until it loads, right? And then click here play and you just start playing. So this is what the users will do. They know what the people will do. I just call them users because this is like a computer, but yeah, I should call them people, they're not users because this page is not like for users and like they don't have to sign in or anything to play these games, but you can e even add that function. So we, you can add a sign in function, a register function, you just, I think you can do it like this and uh, like sign in. And you have like many of uh, the apps to do it and you can do it um, by yourself too, like here by, um, but you can do it by yourself in developer mode too. So you just like put this and, and then click on input and you can put some inputs to do a register or a signing, whatever. And bye, this was all the video.